Hey guys, so today is the first time we're taking the boat out with the new uh, 2021 F-150 and I uh, just wanted to go over the trailer uh, setup uh, when you connect a, a new trailer. So um, right after I, I plugged the boat in, I got this display message that came up. Um, you know, you can either select an existing trailer in the system, add a new trailer, um, or just, uh, just hit no. Uh, so we're going to add a new trailer. And we're going to say trailer name, let's say um, Stingray, and then hit enter, trailer type, it's just conventional because not a gooseneck, not a fifth wheel, save, yes, so we'll just use the default because it's the, our, our boat's only a 19 foot boat so there's, there's no brakes on the trailer. Just leave that as the default. Uh, this is for the blind spot setup, so it'll act, uh, ask you to put in like the trailer width and length and all that. Yes. So length is well. I guess we'll be a little. Uh, it goes from 18 to 21. So being 19, I'd rather it be a little more, um, you know, uh, conservative. So we'll say 21. Great, and that's it. So the nice thing is, um, when you plug the trailer in, you and now you'll be able to select it. You know between, um, you know the your boat or your RV or your, your utility trailer. You know really anything you have. When you select that, it'll actually save your your settings for your your brake types, uh, but more importantly, your brake effort and your brake gain. Um, you know, for example, on our RV, because of the type of hitch we have, which I'll cover in a different video. Um, I will uh, typically have that set to be aggressive, whereas normally on a conventional trailer you wouldn't do that. Um, and then, you know, each trailer is different, so you may have a specific uh, brake gain, so you don't have to keep readjusting it every time, um, you know, you get in and, and switch trailers and things. So I, I really like the feature that it saves the profiles and saves your settings. Um, you know, it just saves, saves time and, um, you know, it's, it's, a, it's a nice convenience, that's all. Hey guys, I want to show off the, um, you know, just how the trailer light check works. So I initiated it a minute ago, it actually go through five times. So it'll start with the left turning signal. Then I go to the right turning signal. And then it'll hit the brakes. And then brakes off. And it'll go through this five times, just so you don't have to be in a hurry. You can, you know, take your time and get to the back of the trailer. Great, so hopefully this video is helpful. Um, if you liked it, hit the like button and uh, subscribe to see more videos like this.